Hi crafty friends, it's Shana from Shinooki Art. I am so excited because my Art Journal August series is just over three months away. In a recent video where I introduced the Art Journal August series, I did speak about a kit being available that I would supply if you would like to get one to be able to work along with me during the series. I want to thank you all for taking the time to comment. I really appreciated all your feedback and have decided to make a new and improved kit. There are now 40 pieces in this Art Journal August kit and one of them is an original by me. Each kit will include one of these. These are made by me. I have made a huge masterboard or multiple masterboards that I have cut down to size. I have stitched around and done some bunched up thread and these fit perfectly as I cover for the journal if you choose to use it like that. It'll come attached to the back of the journal with a large paper clip. It won't be stuck down, so you can use it as you want. I thought to make the kit special, I will add something special. I really hope you like these. I will now go through each piece that is going to be in the kit so you can see exactly what you're going to get. And I'll put a link to my Etsy shop in the description box below because these kits will be available there. They will be $60, which will include postage no matter where you are. So you'll only pay the $60. That is 60 Australian dollars. To convert it to your currency, you can just do that in Google. And just to reconfirm, you don't have to have this kit to do the Art Journal August series. You can use whatever you have. The kit includes a piece of mixed media paper. It is 8 inches by 8 inches and I've left the spiral end on. You will also get a stencil. It is roughly an A5 size and each kit will have a different design. You'll get a napkin. All the napkins in the kit will be the same so we can work together. I found these with hydrangeas, which are my favorite, so I just had to get them. I love the colors and I can't wait to work with those. You will get two pieces of sheet music. One is white, the other is vintage. A little difficult to see on the video, but there actually is quite a big color difference. You will also get two sheets of pages from a book. Again, one is white and the other is more vintage. Again, difficult to see the difference, but the one also has a larger text. You'll get a pack of 10 pieces of scrap papers with different colors, which will be great for our backgrounds. There is also a sheet of sentiments. Now I have these in black with white writing and white with black writing. You will get one sheet, so it'll either be one or the other. There'll also be a white mini envelope, which we're probably going to use for some kind of a page extension. A pack of black and white die cuts, all different shapes and sizes. There will be four pieces of fabric, one with print, one with like an embroidery on, and then a piece of cotton and calico. I'm going to include the masking tape, which I'm wrapping around a playing card just for ease of postage. And because I use it quite a bit, I'm going to include some gold leaf. So we can do some gold leaf pages. They're going to be super fun. And of course, it's going to include the journal that we're going to work in. It is a double-sided or a zigzag journal. There is a signature in the front and a signature in the back. I do have a tutorial how to create one of these. If you prefer to make your own, to do along with the series. I cannot wait to fill this up with you. I'm also going to add a black watercolor pencil to the kit. I use this a lot in my projects and I wanted you to have a go to. In the month of May, I will create a video and show you a full list of supplies for Art Journal August so you can start preparing and collecting your items so you can work along with me. Thank you so much for your interest in Art Journal August. I can't wait to get started with you. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Happy creating and I'll see you again soon. Bye.